I hope you enjoyed your workshops and who are going to report very briefly <laughs> from their respective workshop. Which aspects or questions did you particularly focus on and how did you bring them together? We dealt with um, some aspects so, such as um, how to deal with online and blended learning, which is a very uh, growing trend in education in general. It was also v very highlighted that the time is very scarce for each one of the representatives or the researchers that are involved in these um, centers. So uh, that is a challenge and of course there is um, some recommendation in that regard. Mrs. Stone, reporting from workshop B on uh, the impact uh, on society and uh, policy. What are the underlying conditions or requirements which have been fulfilled, which have to be fulfilled for the centers of excellence in order to operate beyond science uh, to have an impact on society and, and policy or policy? First of all, yeah, contact, contact, contact. <laughs> Contacts and communications are really keywords uh, and networking. Uh, um, and uh, of course, it's clear that uh, research needs to be published, uh, needs to be communicated to, uh, to important stakeholders, uh, that whenever there are conferences, they should be op uh, open to a mixed audience. Um, maybe we can uh, connect directly to workshop C, how uh, joint research question, questions are defined, um, what advantages and synergies arise from the cooperation projects that have been presented in your uh, workshop. Regarding your question to the benefits and synergies, I think what was very obvious is that there are, the, that there are benefits um, that arise from the synergies and the uh, transnational cooperation on at least four levels, which is like the travel of knowledge and, the, and therewith the improvement of research conditions for all participants. Exchange of data, uh, development of infrastructure, also at the kind of more physical level, laboratories, etc., but also at the administrative and program level, because in both experiences, there are kind of co um, um certifications, there are joint certifications, so that has been developed a lot and that has come out of the collaboration. Thank you very much. Thank you to all the three of you for these um, very short, uh, short insights. Thank you for keeping, uh, for keeping it short also.